first of all, it's a, your big comeback to Switzerland here. Um, you're a huge name. You're like one of the biggest names of Swiss football. How was it for you to come back here to, to Beal? Well, it's been a wonderful experience. It's been great to, to be invited to this tournament and you know to, to be able to stay at Everdon where we've got wonderful training facilities and a good hotel. And it's really nice to come back to Switzerland after so many years away. I've had the odd visit but to come back with a team on a training camp, taking part in a tournament, it's been really good. And I'm so pleased tonight that we were able to give a, a good account of ourselves, albeit we are a little bit short of training and a little bit short of first team players at the moment. And now like you had a perfect start into the tournament. I mean, like after two minutes, mm. your team was already leading, um, but still you couldn't take away a win. Uh, how can you explain that today? I mean, like... I hope we had the chances. But a lot of it, of course, is down to the fact that it's our, it's our first game after a six-week break and one week of hard physical training. So the players and the team did much, much better than I anticipated. You know, we knew this was going to be tough for us here because we don't have the, the players at the moment to, to really uh, come and take part against teams like New Zealand and Young Boys who are well into their preparation. Uh, we have so many young players that got their chance tonight, but it's a success for us because those young boys got their chance, they did well, and we ended up not losing the game in, in regular time and winning it on penalties. And now you're going to face uh, the young boys and on Saturday. It's going to be a huge game. Um, the young boys are at the moment the team of the mm. moment. Uh, what do you think? What's going to be the most important um, quality of your team to win this, this big game? But we'll have a chance, I think, with uh, you know, three more days and a bit more training. I'll be able to play the senior players uh, longer than I was able to do today. You know, in the second half, there were only really two or three players who played regularly in the, in the first team. The others were either players who've not played or young players who've not even been anywhere near the first team. I'll be able to play a stronger team, but that will be necessary because we're playing against a stronger team. But again, for us, the important thing in this tournament is to give a good account of ourselves, to play some good quality football, and we certainly did that tonight. And hopefully we can give the young boys the type of test they need before the start of their season, uh, which I think is about one week after they play us, because they have a European qualification. We're, we're building up to the 10th of August, so at the moment, you know, what happens, you know, you say it's a, a big game, I'm sorry, it's not a big game for Crystal Palace, you know, our big game comes on the 10th of August, this is just one step along the way, it'll be the second match we play in our pre-season training, normally we don't play matches for two weeks when we come back to training, so it's unusual for us to play matches in the second week of training, especially against quality opposition like Lucerne and Young Boys, but if the players can do as well as they've done tonight, I think we'll give a very good account of ourselves. But I think the public in Bern will enjoy watching us play. Perfect. Thank you very much. And My see pleasure. you on Saturday.